5 Luxury Apartments That Will Amaze You Before we start, I would want you to hit that red subscribe button so you never miss out on any of our videos. Who owns the most expensive house in the world? Where is the most expensive house in the United States? What amenities from garages that can hold double digit number of cars to regulation sized basketball courts and multiple swimming pools are considered standard these days for most expensive mansions in the world? Discover the answer to those questions and so much more, including a look at some of the properties Amazon founder and outgoing CEO Jeff Bezos has picked up during his recent real estate spree. With this look at 25 Palatil Hill homes from skyscrapers in India to hilltop mansions in California, you may be even to find inspiration for your own garden or pull from that Beverly Hills manse that appeared in The Bodyguard, The One, the Bel Air manse that features five swimming pools and is one of the most expensive homes in the United States, or from Oprah's Rose Garden in Montecito. After all, there's perhaps no better version of escapist fun than indulging your lifestyles of the rich and famous fantasy. Happy dreaming! Number 5. Les Palaises Boulets, Thiel sur Mer, France Estimated value, $390 million. Designed by Hungarian architect Antti Lovage and built between 1975 and 1989, the Bubble Palace features a series of round rooms that spill down a rocky cliff overlooking the Mediterranean Sea. While Lovage was reportedly inspired by man's earliest dwellings in the caves, the seaside estate, not short on modern comforts, featuring three swimming pools, several gardens, and 500-seat amphitheater on the hillside grounds, Bubble Palace is currently owned by Italian-born French fashion designer Pierre Cardin as a holiday home and has been the setting for many swanky events. In 2015, Dior showed its cruise collection at an indoor-outdoor fashion show at the sprawling estate. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Hello. Wow. <laughs> Look at this. Number four, Via La Cedres Saint Jean Cap Ferret, France. Estimated value four hundred and ten million dollars. Built in eighteen thirty, then purchased in nineteen oh four by Belgium's King Leopold II. This mansion was considered to be the most expensive house on the market in the world when it went up for sale in 2017 for $410 million by Davide Campari Milano, SPA of Campari Ground, the property's current owner. Set on 35 acres of manicured gardens and named for the cedar trees on the ground, the 18,000 square foot, 14 bedroom estate boasts an Olympic sized swimming pool, a large stable, and a decadent interior. Think ginormous crystal chandeliers, intricate gilded woodwork, and 19th century oil paintings fit for the opulence of the home's belle époque heyday. And cedar trees that gives the house the name. A bronze statue of Athena wrapped with a marble tunic stands guard at the front stands. Number 3. Whitenhurst in London, England. Estimated value $450 million. Built in the early 20th century, the Georgian Revival Mansion is the second largest residence in London. Clocking in at over 90,000 square foot, Wittenhurst houses 65 rooms, including 25 bedrooms. The house has been used as a filming location for large and small screen productions, including The Lost Prince, Tipping the Velvet, and Fame Academy. Number 2. Via La Leopolda and Ville Franche sur Mer, France. Estimated value $750 million. Owned by Lily Safra, widow of Lebanese-born Brazilian banker Edmund Safra, this 11-bedroom, 14-bathroom estate is perched on 50 acres in France Alpamertes department in the Côte d'Azur region. The property features a commercial greenhouse, helipad, outdoor kitchen, and stunning pool that was setting for Alfred Hitchcock's 1955 film To Catch a Thief. Via La Leopolda is named for its original owner, King Leopold II of Belgium, who gifted the estate to his mistress. Blanche Zia Josephine Delacroix in the early 20th century. The home was redesigned by American architect Ogden Codman Jr. in the 1920s. Number 1. Buckingham Palace in London, England. Estimated value $2.9 billion. With 775 rooms, including 52 royal and guest bedrooms, 78 bathrooms, and 92 offices, the Queen of England's London home still holds the top ranking for the most expensive house in the world. Although the British Crown's trust owns many castles and estates throughout the United Kingdom, Buckingham Palace has been the monarchy's official residence since 1837. Queen Elizabeth II spends her annual summer holiday at Balamore Castle in Scotland's Highlands. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so you never miss an amazing video from us.